Almost everyone by now has heard that LEDs are more efficient. But how exactly do they save you money? Well, maybe the easiest way to explain it is by running a scenario of three bedrooms, each having a can light. The first bedroom uses a 40 watt incandescent regular A19 bulb. The second, a 15 watt CFL. And the third, a 7 watt LED A19 bulb. Each of these bulbs would give an equivalent light level in the room. We're going to compare what it costs to run each light bulb. But first, we need a quick explanation of electricity, how your appliances use it, and how your utility charges you for it. Every electrical appliance in your home will need electricity to power it, and the amount varies between each appliance. The 42-inch plasma might take 350 watts when it's on. Your clothes dryer might consume 1,500 watts when it's being used. And if you're using a 40-watt light bulb to light up a small bedroom, well, it takes 40 watts. A watt is a measure of power used and the total that all your appliances are drawing right now in your home could range from 400 watts in the dead of night to 7,000 watts when everyone comes home in the evening. As you can see, the total power being drawn changes from moment to moment. A kilowatt hour is 1,000 watts used for one hour, and everyone will find the price your utility charges you for a kilowatt hour on their utility bill. In the US, it ranges from 10 to 25 cents. Utility companies all over the world charge their consumers for electricity by installing a meter on the outside of the house where the power line comes in off the street. That meter has a little disc that spins slowly when a little electricity is used and much faster when a lot is used. So how does the utility know how much electricity is used for the month? They write down the kilowatt hours from the meter at the beginning of the month and then again at the end. Like you can see in this utility bill, 1485 kilowatts for the period Feb 20 to March 20. And at 15 cents per kilowatt hour, that's $222. Let's come back to our light bulb scenario. It's pretty easy to calculate the cost of running those light bulbs for a year, but first we have to make some assumptions. Let's first assume you use a light bulb in your room for about six hours a night. That's about 2,000 hours of use every year. If you wanna change that number to more or less, please go ahead. Next, we input what you pay for electricity, let's say 15 cents per kilowatt hour. And now the easy part, 2,000 hours times 15 cents times how many kilowatt each bulb uses. 1,000 watts is equal to one kilowatt. So a 40 watt bulb is 0.04 kilowatts. 2,000 times 15 cents times 0.04 is $12 running cost for the year for the 40 watt incandescent bulb. $4.50 for the CFL and $2.20 for the LED running cost for the year. This formula is easily adapted to other types of bulbs. On average, lighting accounts for 25% of a home's electricity usage. So another way of looking at the savings of LED is to take a quarter of your bill and reduce it by 85% if you switch from incandescent bulbs or by 50% if you want to go from CFL to LED. There are more savings to be had with LED, such as spending less on replacement bulbs. In the next part of this series, we go through another cost savings calculation, including the cost of the bulb.